What's up, everybody? Welcome back to a new video. Today, and I know it's been a while, so I apologize, but today we are doing the uh, new Lord of the Rings Magic the Gathering Universes Beyond Tales Middle Earth. This is the bundle. Um, I don't collect magic. I think I've only ever opened like two packs of magic, but I, I like Lord of the Rings quite a bit, and so I was like, let me try this. This is what it comes with. You get the uh, traditional foil and basic land cards. You get these awesome four alternate art traditional uh, foil borderless Mount Doom scene cards, reference cards, the packs, and then the uh, the box, and then the oversized spin down life counter. So you cannot get the serialized rings out of this. I believe you can get the regular rings, but you can't get the serialized, so the numbered ones, but you can get the regular ones. So that's always kind of cool. So we're going to just open up and see what it looks like. Um, I did watch some video breaks of this stuff, of the, the expensive, like I think it's a collector booster boxes. And uh, those are the ones where the ring is and all that stuff. Um, if you guys are tracking all that. I, I thought the artwork looked really cool. So I wanted to at least see some of the artwork in person. So that's why I decided to get one of these. Just to try it out because you do get some booster packs. Um, okay, so what is this? My name is growing all the time. I like a very long, long story. So my name is like a story. Okay, mm, interesting. Some artwork there. Pretty cool. That came inside the box. So if you haven't seen one of these, it just came out today. You haven't seen these yet. Um, this is what it looks like. It's, look at the artwork on these. These the artwork on these is just fantastic. Abs I mean, Magic has always had great artwork, um, even though I've never been into Magic. But uh, let's see what's in here. So we've got our oversized dice counter. That's pretty cool looking. I know some people buy these things just for the, the dice, or will buy just the dice online. So there we go. Empty box there. Put that up top here. There's our packs. These are the set booster packs. And then we have some goodies in here. So this looks like the the foil land cards and stuff, I guess, with what they would be. All right. Uh, yeah, foil and regular basic lands. Okay, put those up there. This is this should have the uh, the the foil art cards in it. Let's see. I think other some other maybe some other stuff in here. So there's Frodo, Sarns, Bane. These should be the four. One, two, three, four. Yeah, okay. And then there's the more basic. These aren't the full art cards like in the, the packs, but okay, so we're gonna sleeve these four up because these four are awesome looking. The artwork on these is really fantastic. Just to give you an example here. So there is Gollum, Patient Plotter. There's one. Here is the one ring, legendary artifact. It's cool looking, the foil and stuff on there. And there's Samwise the Stonehearted. And my light in here is not really that great, but pretty cool. And then Frodo Sauron's Bane. Pretty cool. In the back here, yeah. <laughs> and unfortunately, they're off-center. Well, at least that one was. The other ones don't look too bad, but the one of them looks a little off-center. So, okay. Let's go ahead and rip into this and see what we get. Um, trying this out for the first time, obviously. These are going to be hot, hot, hot until somebody pulls that one ring. Oh, boy, these things open real easy. Not quite like the uh, other the collector's booster packs or whatever that I've seen in the past. All right, so this. Lord of the Rings art series. Oh, okay, I see. It's an art art card of some kind. So yeah, this is the difference here versus the uh, regular ones and the full art ones that come in these. So you guys let me know in the comments below if I missed something. Bunch of comments here. All right, and then uncommons. You can see down there, common and uncommons. Gore bag of minus Morgul. I don't know how you say that. Sauron's trickery, uncommon. Samwise a stone heart. Uh, here's a rare. Isildur's fateful strike. And we get Sarman the white, uncommon foil. Uh, and then human soldier. Okay, so we got one foil in that, and then we did get our, our rare here. All right. 
So looks like the, the one rare per pack, I guess. Like, although I guess I think it says you can get more than that. Here's another art card. This is 48 out of 81. All right. These should be all the commons up front. Samwise the Stouth Hearted, uncommon. Tale of, yeah, that card. <laughs> Gift of Strands, another common. Witch of Angmar, uh, oh, is that M for Mythic? That's pretty cool looking. It's not foil, obviously, but. And Flowering of the White Tree is our rare. Put that over there. And Enraged uh, Huron, Common Foil, and Spirit. Okay, next pack. All right, another art card. These are pretty cool looking. Horn of Gondor. It says the artist too, which is pretty cool. So those are pretty neat. All right, kind of goes a little bit faster here. Oops, the wrong pile over here. Soulborn the Wise, a mere Legolas counter of kills. Pretty cool, uncommon. Legendary creature elf. Lash of Balrog, and this should be the rare, right? Yep, Min minus. Tirith, Legendary Land, and Nasty End. Yikes. Dude's getting the knife in the throat. Cool looking. And Retaliation. Uh, yeah, okay. Let's say like a like an old school throwback card. All right, next pack. Nice, cool looking art there. Gandalf, Friend of the Shire, Uncommon. Elrond, Lord of Rivendell, another nice one, Uncommon. And another Uncommon, Rosie Cotton of South Lane, and the rare is Smeagol, Helpful Guide, nice. That's kind of, that's pretty cool. And Gim Gimli's Axe is our foil. It's a pretty cool looking card. Obviously it looked better if it was if it was a foil version, which I'm sure it would be if it was in the, the collector booster packs, or whatever they're called. But we definitely know who he is, Smeagol Helpful Guide. Alright. my precious. Yeah. We know who he is. Oh, that's cool looking. That one's got some like a foil name on the front. Pretty neat. Foil land card. All right, and another Elrond, Lord of Rivendell, Storm of Sauron. This must be the, um, I think it ends mythical. If you can correct me if I'm wrong. Pretty cool. And our rare is Fall of Gilgalad. It says, as this saga enters, so something in you know, Uncommon, Ekrenbard, Lord of Westfold. Okay. Again, I don't know exactly what I'm fully looking at here. I've only opened ma a couple of magic packs many years ago. So you'll have to help me if I miss something. Please let me know. Art series. Pretty cool looking card there. All right. Shadow Facts, Lord of Horses. Oath of the Grey Host. Knights of Dormoth. Ooh, Gandalf the Grey, rare, nice. That's cool looking. And the foil is Faramir Field Commander. Nice, legendary creature human soul. That's pretty cool looking. Like that. Got a Smeagol and a Gandalf rare. Gandalf the Grey, that's a cool looking card too. Legendary creature. Pretty cool. All right, two more packs. Two more chances at getting just a regular ring card, which would be awesome, obviously. Pretty cool art there. Sam Loyal Attendant by Campbell White. 
great haul. All right, let's see what we got. Entish Restoration, Quick Beam, Nasty End. There's our rare Eamir Marshal of Rohan and a foil of Oliphant. That's pretty cool looking, those big, crazy looking elephants. And food. <laughs> All right, last pack here of our set boosters, and then we'll see. Uh, we'll see. Hopefully, we get something. Last chance here to to get something. There's our Smaug, and then here's an art card, and it is Emir the R Ritter Mark. Okay. And Bill the Pony. <laughs> Interesting, interesting name horse there. Stu the Conies. Uh, Shire Sheriff, our rare's coming up. I think one more here. Gimli, Counter of Kills. And, oh, it's a myth, another mythic here. Palantir of Orthane. And, oh, instead of a rare, it's that. Legendary Artifact, and then Glorious Gale is the uh, foil. Pretty cool common. That one's okay. So no ring in this box. Uh, we did get some pretty, pretty cool looking, pretty cool looking foils and rares for sure. Um, I didn't see any foil rares. We got some mythic cards, which I think is pretty neat. I think those that's what the M is for. So some pretty cool ones there. And uh, our, I think I think our two best cards for rares, anyways, were Smeagol, Helpful Guide, and Gandalf the Gray. Uh, and then of course we got the I think guess the, the promos. So, which make a little a little image, right? If you put them like that, so you've got the Gollum in the One Ring, and Samwise, and Frodo. Uh, so we did get one of the rings. We I will say we did get one of them, which is this one, uh, which is guaranteed. But anyways, that's it, guys. Thanks for watching. I uh, hope you enjoyed it. This gives you maybe a little bit of idea as to what these uh, bundle boxes might, might look like. You're getting you're getting you know the guaranteed uh, of these, including the, you know one of the rings. You get the, the dice, the packs, you know, the uh, foil, foil lands, all that kind of stuff. So hope you enjoyed it. Let me know what you think in the comments below, and good luck on trying to find some rings. Take care, everybody, and I'll catch you next time.